Hello Yatris, welcome back to our Yatri Cloud. I'm Yatha Chauhan. Today I'm going through how to write proposal for GSOC 2025 and what are benefit. The first one you will be getting $700 to $1500 type 1 in this uh, period of the GSOC 2025. So application is open now. So I'm going to give you the three direction. The first one, how to select organization. Second, how to contribute using GitHub and how to create a pull request and what is the necessary things third one is about how to write proposal for your code correct so we'll give you some samples and we'll give you some insight what you need to take care about your proposal and what not so stay tuned with me this video and by end of this video are you ready to write your proposal and contribute your skill set into the solving the problems which is already listed out the projects via some organization so this is from the google summer of code now today let's get start with our video and subscribe now to the yatri cloud and hit the like button if you wanna start your contribution in gshock 2025 of course yes right so let's get start here what you need to take care about the first one just log in with your id the google address and then go to your contribution and here you can see now application is open now that's why it's showing me so proposal so i didn't submit anything so just click on the browse and here the different different organizations are listed here so based on your tech stack just go with artificial intelligence or data whatever you want so let's scroll down and here is some popular organization which already listed so let's select any one of now and then you are going to check out view idea list and second is about submit a proposal so what we are going to do first let's check it out ideas right and then based on the idea and based on our research based on our skill set we are write one proposal and we are going to submit this and after the review we are going to select it into gsoc 2025 or not that would be we informed by gsoc in next 8 May. So let's go with our timeline first. So you will getting understand. Uh, let me scroll down, go to program timeline, and here you can see the 24th March application is open. The deadline is the 8th April, and then you can say the 8th May our GSOC application would be announced. Who are going to select it, and then in the June and July period, you are actually coding experience would be start from your organization so let's start how to achieve this uh, gshock 2025 so let's back to our proposal here you can see just click on the view idea list and you have different, different ideas from particular organization correct so let's click on anyone let's i'm go with a structural timing in julia so click here and here three one are mentors correct so first click on any project idea and here you can see the description about the project and uh, what is the you know some necessary things which you need to understand and the left side you can see the text please make sure not it down right it would be really helpful us when we are going to submit the application so text then you can say the project size and difficulty please make sure and the mentors correct so after clarifying each and everything based on your skill set go to any this uh, github repo correct so go to the github repo let's go to into new tab and paste it here so here is the project and go to the issue section here you find out different different issues so based on the issues you are going to solve it and you are going to create a pull request correct so just sort this problem okay clone the repo and create a pull request right so go to pull request after solving the problem and create one so if you don't know how to create a pull request and how to push the code check it out my github playlist i'm giving you the link in the description and the i button also so check it out once so after creating the pull request we are next step go with our submission right but before the submission I'm suggesting to you, uh, whatever you are written it out, project title, description, the project size, which really take care about your application. So do not select any 
as per your choice no just ask your mentors correct and just discuss with them that i i want to contribute in the jisa creativity 5 in your organization so what is the necessary point which i can take care about my submission so we are going to do this so go to back and here you can see this is a three mentors for this project so select anyone and connect with her uh, connect with them and uh, suggest your ideas give your excitement give your enthusiastic about your coding skills your ideas and based on your conversation you will be asking your doubt okay so that is the one suggestion from my side okay uh where is the our submission proposal yeah so let me back again Mm, okay 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 let's uh, let's back yeah submit the proposal so proposed titles summaries uh, size project technology so here you can see the project text tag would be adding here uh, as you can see this one when you are clicking on the project the all the text tag are mentioned here so make sure based on your project text tag you are going to enter the text tag here correct then project topics the same way every mentioned in the projects also in the github repo correct then select the proposal so proposal i am going to showcase it to you so here is the one proposal mission support system and enhance kml support so this is the one idea this is the one uh, you can see the template which you can follow to write your proposal so mention out your basic details then your education background then you can see your contribution your issues your pull request you need to mention here then your details about the project then description with any graph right any visualization it would be really helpful to you next one here you need to take care about uh the main milestone what we are going to achieve and next one is about how it project actually solved a problem correct then giving the solution via test cases via some graph information and then give the timeline what in your mind how i am going to complete this project within the deadline correct so take a reference then you can say the commitment eligibility why and uh, some basic information okay so just take care about your points whatever you are going to mention in your proposal so this is some majority point which i am going to show showcase it to you second proposal is there let me go to this one so this is one global alliance for the genomics and health on the react clinic and the research data collection okay so pre clinic and the research data collection is one of the healthcare issue a uh, one healthcare topics which you can say so here is the table of content so check it out once i will give you the all the proposal in the jisok yatri in particular discord channel give you the link in the description correct so personal introduction work experience your previous project experience then you can say why again okay then your problem statement then type of your techniques okay what you are going to use then you can say some graphical information and also your code how your code would be helpful in the, your organization okay course snippet then you can go with architecture okay if you are using any development side or some specific one then you can go with a project setup some microservice architecture if is there so must you need to include in your proposed idea okay so you can see some basic information about you know project here is a, some ui information you need testing cicd pipelines so you know this is the ssd cycle which you are going to cover it out from idea to your code code to your particular execution the ui and then you are going to go on test cases in the production with the cicd and then you are going to give some timeline and then the reference and some more information about your project clear so i hope it's a clear with you all of you how what is the necessary things which you need to take care about it so this is the main point so after clearing out each and everything please submit your proposal by uh, before the deadline 
so for mention all the details please reaching out to your mentors do not submit directly via your own self again do not ask uh, to your friends again just because of this is based on your mentors so if you already touch with your mentors if you already contribute your skills in the data so they already knows you so after submit a proposal if this is okay then you are directly going to select into the gshock 2025 so yeah that's it as of now majority i cover it about what you should take care about it okay if you want the more information we are discussing out in the gshock yatri in the discord channel and give you the best of luck and let me know if there are any other questions just put it down in the comment box and i will give you the reply so bye bye take care